Today, let's see something more interesting related to static blocks. Since past few days, I was creating videos on the static block and then you guys were also very interested in this, but there were many doubts also. So I thought let's make today's video also on this static block only. So again, I'm having a static block, something like this. And now what do you think what will happen if I will execute the same? You will say that, okay, as you showed earlier, first of all, it will say hi. And then it is going to say in me because always, first of all, the static block will be executed and then the main method will be executed. Now, what if I move the static block after the main method? Now, what do you think what is going to happen? So someone was thinking that, okay, now it may print in main first and then it is going to say hi. Because generally, whenever we are learning Java or some other code language, what we feel is that it is going to execute line by line. So first of all, let's see what is going to be the output. So here also you will see that again on executing the same again, it will say hi first and then it is going to say in me because the rule is very simple. First of all, static block will be initialized and then only the static methods will be initialized. But what if I remove the static word itself from here? Now, what do you think what is going to happen? Now you will say that, okay, Abhishek, this is looking very strange. Like this is not even a method and this is not even a static block. So what it is, so what it is going to do. And I guess it is going to execute the same way only. So if we execute, now it is just going to say in main, because now this is not a static block. Instead, this is an instance block, which means that it will get executed only and only when you are going to create an instance of the demo class. So in order to make it work, what we need to do is we need to write something like this new of demo, something like this, and then this. And here, let me make this E as small. And now let me just execute the code. Now you see, first it is saying in main, and then it is going to say hi. Here, the reason for this kind of output is that first of all, when this main method start, so first line was in main, then you created an instance of demo and hence this instance block got initialized and hence it is printing high after this. In case if you will say new demo before in main, then you will see the output is going to reverse here. Do like the video if you learned something new today. Thanks.